What's good, people? It's Taco No Safety, and I'm back with another video. Y'all seen the thumbnail and title, so y'all know we in a new era for compact firearms, and I'm loving them. They getting smaller and capacity getting bigger. We got three firearms here that I love near and dear to my heart, some more than others, but they all special to me. We got the Hellcat Pro. Firearm is clear. Every gun I show y'all today will be clear, but I will clear them for y'all. Hellcat Pro, look at that butter. Mm. Then we got the Sig S Macro. A lot of people don't like this gun. A lot of people had issues with it. I haven't, but we'll get into it. Then, let me throw it back in the holster for y'all. Mm. Then, we got the 43X. Bam, clear as well. Big Glock store mag on the bottom. Can y'all see that? Clear. Mm. This gun was in my last one, uh, maybe my last one or two videos, but it's a 43S. Everybody love the 43S. We could talk about it again. Although out of these three, capacity, boo boo. Let's get to the Hellcat Pro. Man, I love this gun. I think last time I did a video on it, I called it a single stat firearm, and some of y'all want to smoke about that in the comments. I guess it's a stack and a half. I don't know, but it's a small firearm. As y'all can see, matter of fact, I do have a clear Gen 5 Glock 19 right here. And as y'all can see, it is a lot smaller. You may not be able to tell on camera, but it's definitely a lot smaller. But as y'all know, she holds 15 rounds. Same capacity as the Glock 19. And if you feel both of them in hand, the Hellcat Pro is absolutely smaller. That's what I love about this gun. 15 rounds in a good package, man. It ain't snappy. It ain't too bad. Unlike that damn the OG Hellcat. I don't care what nobody say. That gun was snappy as hell. If you might want to look at some previous re uh, videos, I'm pretty decent at managing recoil. But that Hellcat Pro, that I mean that original Hellcat, snapping turtle. But anyway, the Hellcat Pro, man, as y'all can see, I got the Holla Sun 507K and the TLR7A on it. It does not need the sub. You can put the regular TLR7A on it. Stainless steel magazine. And no rust, no nothing, man. I done went jogging with this gun, running with this gun, sweating in this gun, workout in this gun, tripped in this gun, fell in this gun. I done did everything in this gun, and it ain't failed me. It ain't let me down. And please don't fail me now. Yeah, man, I can smell the gun smoke, man. Look at the trigger. Take up, wall. First of all, first thing I want to say, I don't know if I'm going to be able to get y'all a good look at it, but the trigger is wide, man. Big, fat old trigger up in there. Right? Easy to get up in there. You feel it. You can get on the wall. There's the wall. Bang. The only thing about it, it is kind of, of a long reset. You know what I'm saying? Similar to a Glock reset. Let's see. Clear. Clear. Safe direction. Let's see. Actually, that 19 reset actually will feel a little bit shorter than a uh, than Hellcat Pro reset. But we'll look at it again. I'm trying to get y'all a good view at it. Ah, uh, yeah, absolutely. It's longer, but... The trigger in itself, as far as the break to the wall, yeah, yeah. Glock wish they made triggers like this. Hell, it, it, they performance trigger probably more similar to this that you gotta pay an extra hundred dollars for. This come in it, man. Hellcat Pro, beautiful gun. I shoot it great. Uh, you can check out uh, my old Hellcat Pro video that I got up there. It's a, it's a pretty old video, but. I, uh, it's a video of me shooting it in there at the range, and this gun is fantastic. Absolutely recommend if you are looking for a smaller compact firearm to where it kind of do all to where if you want to have fun at the range, you want to play basketball, jog, run, cut the grass, check the mailbox, go pick up the kids from the bus stop, whatever you need to do, the Hellcat Pro will handle it, man. 15 round mass, and I think they make 17 round mass for it now so all around 
fire compact pistol. I mean, ain't really too much I can say about it, man. We'll get it at the range soon. Let's move on. We getting right to business in this video. Then we got the infamous clear, clear, the infamous Sig X Macro, man. I don't know, man. You either love this gun or hate this gun. I done heard people, as you can see, it's got the beautiful comp cut in there. Yeah. Gunpowder. Man, listen. A lot of people don't like this gun. They said they had rust issues, magazine rust issues. Um, I guess uh, it was discharging on its own, negligent discharges. I'm a, I don't know if y'all got a lemon or a defect, but I got a lot of rounds with my S macro and I ain't had no problems whatsoever. I ain't had no discharges. I ain't had no rust issue. I done jawed in this gun, sweated on this gun and everything else. Cause she slim thick, you know what I'm saying? You can do everything with an old slim thing with a, with a nice round count. You know what I'm saying? Big, nice grip you can get on it. And I got pretty, I got decently sized hands, you know what I'm saying? I ain't no mammoth or nothing like that, but I got decent sized hands, <clears throat> you know what I'm saying? Where I do require, uh, uh, you know, um, healthier grips, you know what I'm saying? But this gun, I can get a great purchase on it. And even though it's a, oh, my bad, y'all. Even though it's, uh, I consider it a, a, it's more like subcompact, slim thick size, but it's considered a compact gun. I can get an excellent, excellent grip on this gun. This is actually probably the damn near the only SIG that I like. I'm going to keep it real with y'all. You know what I'm saying? I ain't no real big fan of the SIG, really, because 320. I know they got a history of having issues and stuff. You know, shoot, you know, cops shooting themselves in the leg, respectfully. Um... You know what I'm saying? Uh, firing on its own and all that. So I know when people started hearing that with the X macros, they, they ain't want to take no chance. And I don't blame y'all, but I own it. I've shot it. I've carried it. I've jumped in it. I've I've done, I've worked out with it. I've done it all with it. And I ain't had no issues with it whatsoever. We got the TLR7 sub on it. With the uh, Hollow Sun, this is the 407K. You know what I'm saying? I prefer the small MOA dot anyway. The sm very small little tiny dot. I don't really care for the ring with the circle. I mean, it's cool and all. If that's what you went to, that's what you went to. But me, I ain't really tripping on it. You know what I'm saying? Um, man, this gun pressure, man. You know what I'm saying? This gun fire. Highly recommend. If you win the SIG or if you win to having the smaller um uh you know skinnier gun that has 17 round capacity you know what i'm saying 17 rounds in that thing man then uh check it out you know what i'm saying and it's got the cup in there you know what i'm saying it's it's damn it's flatter than the the hellcat for show sure. you know what i'm saying i i mean you know what I'm saying? it is flat it's flat shots for the size it's cool you know what i'm saying but um i don't really care for it to be flat i do i'm 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 all right with manager recoil so you know what i'm saying it does help i'm cool with it let's take a look at the trigger we still clear show y'all one more time we clear look at that now the trigger you know see it got them triggers now i ain't even gonna hold y'all see it got them triggers now you know what i'm saying they go to wall real short wall take up to the wall bang uh, reset nice and short and it push man positive reset it's gonna throw your finger back you know what i'm saying it's throwing it back it's throwing it back bang you know what i'm saying let me take this man y'all just to show y'all the reset one more time nice and short man Bang. I love this gun. I absolutely love this gun. If you have rust issues or discharges and all that stuff and it forced you to get rid of your S macro, I'm sorry, dog. I feel for you because I hate to get rid of my S macro, man. So, genuinely, from Taco No Safety, I'm sorry, man. Let's move on, man. Now, we got. 
the clear, the infamous, the 43X. When it comes to capacity, Glock, Boo Boo, Doo Doo Water, 10 rounds, 10 rounds, dog. Flush fit with this gun right here is 10 rounds. Now, I ain't gonna lie to y'all, it's phenomenal. It's a great gun. Actually, it's one of my favorite triggers for a Glock. I believe, in my opinion, Gen 3, Gen 5, best triggers in Glock. Glock 43X, people talk about how sharp the trigger is. You know what I'm saying, how crisp it is. I got some word of advice for y'all. Go get a shovel, right? And just dig some holes. You know what I'm saying? Dig some holes or go get a socket wrench. And just tighten some bolts. You know what I'm saying? Go, go get a, uh, go get some sandpaper and lather it on your hands like lotion, so you can rough your hands up. Because if you complaining about this trigger being sharp, dog, you got some soft ass hands. You must be, you must, you gotta be a doctor or something. Cause I mean, this trigger pressure. But that's just my opinion. You know what I'm saying? Best. This is the best Glock trigger. Bang! Look at that reset. Kind of long, but short for a Glock. I've seen worse. Bang! You know what I'm saying? I absolutely love this gun. I got the 10 round uh, old Glock OEM mag with the Glock store base plate. Uh, I got plus three out of it. Holosun 407K with the uh, PSA dagger micro slide on it. So I can um uh, so I can throw the uh the red dot on it. And then I got the TLR6. Trash. Need some batteries every damn every other week and need some new batteries. You know what I'm saying? Let me see. Yeah, the light, it light work a little bit. You know what I'm saying? But it worked for me. Perfect EDC gun, you know what I'm saying? With capacity. Some people trust Glock more than anything else, so they'll take the limit in the capacity over like your uh throw that thing in the holster for y'all uh over like your sig x macro which is let's do a size comparison which is a little longer a little longer in the grip and a little longer in the uh in the slide so but for 17 more rounds it ain't that damn much longer it ain't that damn much bigger for, to get a whole another seven rounds in there with a flush fit magazine. So, I mean, just to give y'all a good look. I don't know what the hell Glock doing over there, but if they don't start innovating, they gonna start losing some people. The damn reliability of a Glock, it ain't, I mean, they ain't that damn good just to just to not, just to give us the same damn thing every year like, like Jordan, like Michael Jordan. Here we get the same retro Jordans every year just a different color that's the same thing glock do they damn put a different color black on it and call it a new gun it's still black it just ain't matte black this year they want to do gloss black you know what i'm saying or you know and then bruh they wildin man glock be wildin but you know at the end of the day i'm one of them guys that love glock i'm a glock man i mean i can show y'all i got two glocks right here I mean, you know what I'm saying? I got, I'm just gonna show y'all. Just so y'all don't think I'm one of them guys just talking trash about Glock, we clear. Got another Glock right here. You know what I'm saying? I mean, bro, I can show y'all, I can show y'all Glocks. Got another Glock right here. And I got another Glock, then I got another Glock put up. So I ain't just one of them dudes just talking shit about Glock and don't own no Glocks. No, I own Glocks. I own more Glocks than anything else. But these two right here, when it comes to the 43X, this way you need to be. Trust me. This way you need to be. Coming from a Glock fan, Hellcat Pro, Sig S Macro, P365, whatever. There's other alternatives out there. So all my all my hood stars, you know what I'm saying? It's other, it's other guns out there, dog. It's other guns out there, trust me. You know what I'm saying? Something else I wanna say. You got these 30s or these 29s, 
Yeah, you like that? Yeah. Trash. Throw them damn things in the trash. You way more dangerous with this right here. Way more dangerous with, with something like that. Extra two rounds and you good to go. You know what I'm saying? I just wanted to talk real quickly and briefly about um, new era compact guns and where compact guns are headed. Hopefully Glock can catch up with everybody else. You know what I'm saying? I hope y'all enjoyed the video. This was a quick little smash, quick little quick little something for for the app for y'all you know what i'm saying just to let y'all know um i'm listening you know what i'm saying um i appreciate all the comments and support i've been getting lately man channel been going up i'm proud of that i appreciate y'all y'all know the vibes y'all know how we coming stay alert stay deadly stay dangerous Taco no safety, and I'm out.